How do you feel about a tube fly? I'd rather intrude. It's an intruder. Well, let me see what you got. That bad boy? Oh, those are huge, dude. I like it. Or you could throw something like, uh, something like oh, that. Oh, yeah, dude. I'm gonna fish this. What are you going to fish? I'm going to fish this for sure. The red turkey. I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing off right with this chicken wing. I mean, it's a colored up day. Paul's hitting us up with big bugs, man. Been tying big bugs, feeling pretty good. If you're not throwing a big bug, you're not gonna catch a big dog. <laughs> <laughs> Plain and simple. Oh my God. Rotten, you're rotting in your waders? That's what the early morning will do. This is a good speed. like this and it becomes a tragedy you know i've seen whole teams of guys killed in water like this no you haven't <laughs> you're standing in the perfect water for a tutorial exactly <laughs> the roaring background noise standing right where the fish are gonna be. <laughs> so we just pulled off at this spot there's a main seam that has a big head where connor's standing right now and there's just this really small soft spot this would usually be kind of where some grass is, but on a high water day, I like fishing stuff like this where you can see the top still nervous. It's an obvious spot where they would sit when that's too fast. Throw it out into that faster current, mend it, let it sink, and then I'm coming across this. Essentially what's been created is a bucket, nice and slow, a big fly on, three, two, one, steelhead. Dude, you think you probably need to go get some more coffee or something, right? Maybe think about it a little bit? Yeah, I think I'm gonna go fish the next run. <laughs> <laughs> Is that right? Did you fish down into the juice? Yeah. Oh, my ass you did, dude. You were catching grass the whole time. I fished it good. Yeah, you fished it with integrity? Yeah. That's not a man who fishes with integrity right there. I'm about to sink myself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna change out my sink tip. I've got sink nine right now. I'm gonna go down to sink six. In this high water, grass and bushes along the shore go underwater, and you just keep catching those if you're too heavy. Can I see your snippers? Not a chance on that one. Yeah. Try and fish it with some level of integrity, okay? By the way, you started fishing this run. I can tell you don't plan on fishing this well. <laughs> Got about seven weeks of straight rain coming up, so throwing big bugs. Now I'm effectively swinging in front. See what I'm doing here? That's how you sneak in front. You just extend more line, fish a little bit quicker, and it doesn't matter what position you're in. And we know it's not like grassy, snaggy stuff in there. It's good rocky bottom. bucket into the house above the hatchery there we're gonna check yeah we let's go check. check it all good let's thing go we're look. doing the full float yeah i know right see what you really want to look for is that nice steelhead green yes. <laughs> uh. jig it through So how would you work a run like this? I mean, I'm just trying to soak this on the inside, put it in there and let it soak. Cause some commotion. I'm trying to stir them up, you know. Be swimming Give around. me some dirty water fishing tips. I mean, big fly. Big fly. Realistically, if the water looks like this, you probably should stay home. <laughs> you're gonna make do. You're gonna use a big ass fly. You're gonna let it hang down for about an hour. Okay. You're just gonna plunk it. Plunk it on a nice seam? Realistically. What kind of tip are you using? You can catch fish in this water, but you're gonna have to work a little harder. What kind of tip would you recommend? Light tips. Cover the inside as well. And that's been successful for us. 
<laughs> Not yet. Not yet. It, it pretty much was, and yeah. Because we were, we were, oh, I don't think we have a picture of that one. Of the fish we do. And that's brown. Yeah, but I have one in even dirtier water than the one I landed. That's what I'm saying. Oh, really? Today. This one's never, like, the one that gets our blood pumping, so to believe that... There we go. Dick fish. They what released. Say, right on the barbecue? Oh, it's <laughs> off. Yeah, that looks good. Looks like you got your stroke back. It felt good. You were back on top. Yeah, you just needed to sit one out. <laughs> Sometimes you just need to set a run out, you know? Yeah. Have a deep thought. Get your head back in the game. There you go. Yeah. I need to think about this one. Hope you guys learned something today. Ultimately, if you're not drinking an orange Kirkland sport drink, I don't know. Not a sponsor. <laughs> I mean, check for the code. Five percent off. Do you have a sponsorship that you're not telling me? <laughs> you keep bringing up Kirkland. Use the code. <laughs> Use the code Connor's Kirkland Orange Drink for five percent off. All right. <laughs>